hello everyone thanks for watching this video so in this video today we are going to understand how to find the occurrence of character in a string without using any loop so finding the occurrence of character in a string is a not a big deal we already did in program number one okay if you want to watch you can go through the program number one of the same series okay but the question is we don't have to use any loop without using any loop so this is the only twist we have in this program so overall idea is we have to find the repeated character how many times a, a character got repeated but without using any loop okay so for that we have the input string ready the api pothi and character we have to find the occurrence of character which is i so the our output will be i got repeated two times one and two right so this is our output so we have our main program ready and we have our input also ready now our responsibility is to write the logic to find the occurrence of a character in a string without using any loop right so get occurrence okay so here we are going to pass two things as a argument first thing is a string and the second thing is that the character what we are going to find okay so accordingly we have to create the method right good so we created the method and we received the user input also so as soon as we receive the user input our responsibility is to secure this user input so a string so we can say user string okay so this is the local variable which hold the data coming from the user which is a string and this is the character types so we can say user char okay and let's have one sop also saying that user data okay so here we are going to print the both the value saying that user string plus and we are going to print the characters user characters okay and we are going to print okay so now let's run this program as a java application just to make sure that we received the user input correctly right so run a java application if you see our user string is api pothi where we are going to find the occurrence of character i so we received user input correctly that we are going to print so till now we are good now our responsibility is to find the occurrence of i in this string but term and condition is we should not use any loop okay so okay first we understand the manually how we are going to do later we understand through code how we will achieve it okay so if you see we have the api pothi string right and in this string we are going to find the occurrence of i okay so in this string if you delete this i okay okay not now do one thing okay so um, do one thing let's have one more thing int length of user string first we have to get the length of user string the data the string which is coming from user let's calculate the length okay so print the length also 
length of user string okay now run this one as a java application i will tell you why i am calculating length so length is 8 okay so for this string length is 8 good now if we will delete the i from here what is the length length becomes 6 if you see 3 plus 3 6 right so after deleting the i length becomes 6 and without deleting the i length becomes 8 so i can say that the element which got deleted that is i occurs 8 minus 6 times means characters i occurs 8 minus 6 times let's have some understable format so how many times basically i occurs i occurs two times so what we did is need to understand here very clearly we got the length of the input string we deleted the character how many times the character got occurred and we got the length so we subtract the 8 minus 6 means before deleting the character and after deleting the character so we got 2 and exactly this i occurs 2 times so in that way we are going to achieve the number of occurrence of any character without using any loop so this algorithm we are going to apply through code okay so we have the string ready here that is good we got the length also that is also good now our responsibility is to delete the i that also we will do okay so how we are going to do a string after delete char i am just taking variable name is long but this is just for understandable format you can take any things okay so from this string this is our string right from this string we are going to delete the i and we are going to save in this string right so this string to delete the i we have one method in a string class got replace method if you see replace have two method right and both are over written method okay if you see here first is expecting character and second is expecting character sequence okay so we are going to use this one okay so here we are going to tell okay so delete the i from this string right delete means this one we are going to assign the null okay right so from this so this is the character we are going to pass here okay now question is this replace is not expecting character this aspect a string okay so what we will do is here we can convert this one as a string saying that like that a string user char str equal to character we know right how to convert character to string we just have to add one blank string this consider as a string if you concatenate this one so we got the string so this string if we pass here okay so this will give you the all deleted i you can print it here after deleting the character so after deleting the character we are going to print this one okay now run this as a java application so character is a p p p o t 
so things to understand right we are done with this one right we got this one also see here a p p o t h we got this one now question is that we have to get the length okay so dot length length is integer type int length after delete okay so we are done with this one okay we got this this value also this value assigned here now we got the length also it means we got the six also and let's print this one here just for verification okay now right click run as java application if you see we got the string also and we got the length also now our responsibility is to subtract the length which is before deleting and with after deleting right so we can say that let's have some format here okay so int actual length equal to this is your length minus length after deletion this length is before deleting and this length is after deleting right so if you print this one we are getting the number of occurrence which is this length number of occurrence means 8 minus 6 2 so this i occurred two times right run as java application so number of occurrence 2 good we got the 2 so we can format here as per our output we can prepare the message here so number of occurrence of i i means character so this one occurrence of this one i in api puthi api puthi is what api puthi is actually our user string in api puthi equal to 2 so this will give you the 2 let's see if we are able to manage the our outcomes or not number of occurrence of i in api 42 so number of occurrence of i in we have to give some space here and in api poti so also we have to give some space after in i gave the space fine i think this time we will get the clear output Okay, number of occurrence of i in api both equal to 2 right so we don't need this sop now we just kept for the debugging purpose we will we can delete this one and we can delete this one also and this let it be okay now run this program for clear output we cleaned everything so this is the user data and where the i occurs two times right you can do these are all condition in one sort also okay so one sort means i will tell you how so you can say that uh, later i will comment it okay Uh, 
heart and so here we are going to write the shortcut code so we will say that int count equal to input string means this one dot length okay minus input string dot replace where we are passing replace this one dot length okay done so we will copy this line and paste it this one okay and here we will pass this counter actual length we will replace it here okay so if you comment this code also it should be fine just to check right right click run a java application so output will be same you can use either this code okay or this code also now i am keeping this code only okay this code i am commenting it you but you can achieve in this way also right right click run as java application good so let me summarize you again so we got the string we got the character and our responsibility is to find the occurrence of this character in this string term and condition is we should not use any loop so we received that two input from user one is use string and one is character types okay and first what we did is we calculated the length of the actual string which is coming from user directly and then we deleted the i from the string doing replace method and after deleting we found the length we calculated the length so we got two length first length is before deleting and second length is after deleting and then we subtracted both length and we got the actual number of occurrence so actual length so this length will tell you how many times a particular character got occurred that's what we understand by manual way okay so we got these four lines of code but here we can do these are all operation in single line and we can print it here so it's your choice which one you want to use both are same only okay yeah so thanks for watching this video